Hello, this is David, and today I'm at the iconic London Aquatic Centre, home of swimming at the London 2012 Olympic Games for the AP International Swim Meet 2024. Today is the second part of this two-part video series, for want of a better word, where last week we covered my 50 metres freestyle race, and today we'll be covering my 50 metres butterfly race super excited about this competition because there are some big names at this of swimming at this event including Anna Hopkin, James Guy and of course a big man himself Adam Peaty. So if you give this video a like I would very much appreciate it. Remember to subscribe to this YouTube channel for more swimming content and for swim coaching head on over to westcoff.com but otherwise without any further ado let's dive right in to today's competition. It is the butterfly eats. So a 31.66 in the 50 meters butterfly, which constitutes a long course personal best for me of 0.27 seconds. Really happy with that swim, especially on the basis that my long course 50 meter butterfly races have been somewhat lacking lately. I really haven't even gotten close to dipping under that 32 mark recently. I went a 32.3 at British Masters Nationals and a 32.5 back in Sunderland at the AP Masters meet in March. So really, really happy with that time. Don't know where that's come from, whether it's the pool, the sense of occasion, or maybe me just thinking about my race a little bit more. I was a little bit calmer going into this race, similar to the 50 meters freestyle on Saturday. So I think that may just be a case of me managing my nerves better going into races, focusing on race execution, and that just delivers for me, rather than going in, trying to think about the result, and then ultimately being disappointed when the time isn't as fast as I want it to be. So a really big result here today, really happy with the long course personal best areas for improvement so the guy in the lane next to me I was head to head with all the way going into the finish however he managed to spot the wall better than me and took 0.4 of a second off of his time which just goes to show how the finish on a butterfly is oh so important and getting that right can take off nearly half of a second so a little bit disappointed in that regard because I could have had an even quicker time here today. However, it's also reassuring that I can actually make massive improvements just by working on that small aspect of my swim. And I've got the fitness to go half a second quicker. And it's more just a case of touching up those technical skills in order to take massive chunks off of that time. So things looking really up for me at the minute. We've got about a month or so to go until long course Europeans. You know, put some good swims down here over the course of this weekend at AP International. So I'm now going into Masters long course Europeans feeling massively confident and, you know, super excited for it. But otherwise, it's been a fabulous weekend here at the London Aquatic Centre for the AP International Meet 2024. I've been David Westcoff. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again next time. For more swimming content, click on my profile picture and subscribe to my YouTube channel. For swimming coaching, visit westcoff.com or for another video of mine that I think you'd like, click on the thumbnail.